Welcome back. We're still here. Be sure and tune in to the WLTZ NBC 38 News at 6 this evening. They have discovered that the BRAC expansion at Fort Benning, oh yeah, it's going to lead to some serious traffic problems in this area. Find out the latest results on the traffic studies and how it could affect you. Right now in the studio today, we have some special guests, Justin Ballou, Thank and you. we have Jesse Wilson. Yes. And they're from Golden Acres Church, and they yes, have some music for us. Yes, ma'am. Take it away. All right, thank you very much. This is Just in Time by Jesse Wilson. Well, thank you so much. And she was telling us earlier that you've only been playing the guitar for two, two yes, years. Yes, ma'am. I taught myself. You taught yourself? Yes, ma'am. How does one teach oneself the guitar? You too, My, pretty much. Oh, really? You too? Yes, ma'am. I played the piano and I always thought the guitar was just insane. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the really good news is she makes Justin look good. I've been around Justin for a while. This is the best you've ever looked. Uh-oh. When you, when, you, when you hide behind an accordion and a uh -huh. pretty girl with a guitar, you can really, you can look really good. Learn how to make it in the <laughs> business. Yeah, you, yeah, you, you, you understand this whole face for yeah. radio. Thing. It yeah. works out for you. Yeah, so that's <laughs> awesome. What's the story behind the accordion? This, uh, it's funny. I, my grandmother gave me an accordion that mm -hmm. she had bought for my um, uncle went back in the 50s. 
Wow. And I used the thing, uh, kind of jokingly used it, and it broke a few years ago, mm -hmm. and I wanted to replace it. And when I went to replace it, I found out that my grandmother had paid an awful lot of money in the 50s, and to replace it was quite expensive. And I ended up having to pay well over $1,000 to, to, get, to get an old one just like it. Oh, so, oh, yeah. wow. oh. Oh, yeah, awesome. it's unfortunate that I don't do it much justice, but it's still a cool heirloom to have and something unique. So it is, it is, it it gives a different flair. It does. And and you are the. Uh, I'm the music minister at Golden Acres Baptist Church. Uh huh. Do you get uh, very often to play that in the Baptist church? Occ occasionally, well, occasionally when they uh, when they let me, uh, you know, uh -huh. the, the, they throw stones. But you know, it is a Baptist church. No, I'm kidding. The, the people there are very generous and they uh, they love me. And uh, we, uh, we just have a good time doing well, it. So it's and awesome. don't be so modest. I understand you toured with Casting Crowns. I did back in, uh, back in 06 and uh -huh. uh, early 07. I did, yes, ma'am. Uh -huh. I, I got to play with them on their Life Song tour. So I was kind Speaking of, of the modest thing, tell yeah. her because I never can remember. He has so many instruments. How many do you play? I have about 350. And, and plays every one pl of them. Yeah, play, playing is uh, loosely used. But yeah, I do. I can play enough on them to, to make people think that I can. At Somebody least. challenged him the last mm -hmm. time he was on my radio program. Mm -hmm. to play bagpipes. And wow. I don't know how long it took him to teach himself, but he plays wonderful bagpipes. It took him that long. I mean, bagpipes, one of the most difficult instruments mm -hmm. to play. The guy picks something up, he can play. And we're doing all this bragging on him. You did a wonderful job. <laughs> yes, Great he job, Jesse. Your voice is beautiful. Thank you so much. Yeah, she's awesome. And she's been writing some songs. And she just came out with a CD. that we, just, we did a CD that we produced in our church, and she's got a song on it that we actually did of hers that's going to be coming out in March. So Fantastic. we're pretty excited about that. Well, thank you so yeah. much for joining thank us. You. Awesome. Yeah. We're very thankful. Nice thank you for you. having us on. Uh -huh. Well, this is uh, almost the wrap-up of the D. Armstrong Show. We have this and more coming up after the break.